Hey, Philip, can you hear me? Can you hear me, Philip? Oh, okay, cool, cool. Man, I'm trying to figure this out, man. And a while ago when I was trying to stream, it wouldn't pop up anybody's comments down here, and I had to open up my laptop over here to see if anybody was even showing up on there and, and it showed people was commenting but couldn't figure it out just sitting there tinkering with it trying to figure it out tonight and see what i can do with it i think my internet's running really 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 slow i'm on my phone trying to stream it using my iPhone and now it's actually showing you know your comments on here as I go but I got you Philip so yeah I'm just kind of going through some some of my cards tonight I'll probably have you send me your number and stuff. That way you can try to help me with this. That way I can get this live stream going smoothly anyway. I'd love to hang out with y'all guys like this. Yeah, I got my laptop beside me. I went ahead and turned it on and where I can actually see what's going on. But yeah, I'm gonna kind of go through some of my cards I got here recently. Did you happen to see these right here? I went and got, got some of these or not. Went ahead and posted a video a while ago. It's still uploading. Did some pack wars with my little girl. Just a little bit. We did opened up two boxes and she wasn't feeling too good. So she went to the other room and I just went ahead and opened them for her. All right. So out of my Fairfield tonight, I got that. Yeah, they also had the prime packs there too. I didn't buy them though. They was like almost nine or ten dollars, something like that. I went in. I just bought three of them. We went to another store, kind of goofing off, and uh, my mom's like, "Why don't you go back and buy the other three? I'll buy them for you." So I ended up getting six total.
can't hardly see that, can you? Yes, it's a good value. I don't know how clear that is. Hey, Canadian, how you doing, bud? Man, my computer is like way laggy. So sorry if it's lagging for y'all guys. But I figured I'd show you some of my some of my better cards tonight. Got this Russell Martin. Jersey Kings relic. We got a triple play bat relic the other night out of a box. Got a Clayton Kershaw out of the holiday box that I did a while back. Noah Syndergaard. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know that they had triple, uh, triple play had relics either. Actually, I was kind of confused. I was like, what the heck is this? But it, it also has, you know, on the back, you know, it's an enclosed game used material and it's guaranteed by Panini. Got a Jacob de Grom jersey relic. It's pretty neat. Got that out of Heritage. Got an Al Kaline. Yeah, it just says a bat, and it didn't say a player or anything. It just it said it was a game used. Authentic bat game used relic. Makes no sense. Got a DD Gregorius. Seven twenty on my computer where I can actually see it a little bit better myself. There we go. And this is a Manny Machado. This was my first commemorative patch that I got out of a a pack. It was one of my first time ever opening packs and opened up a box of tops. Got that. Still waiting on my uh, other camera holder because this one right here, man, I got it sitting on my dang box and every time I move it'll bounce around. But I got this one. I don't even know this guy, but I got this out of that Fairfield a while ago, but it was numbered. It was 752 out of 899. As I my daughter's pack. Hey, hobbyist, how you doing? Just trying to test the waters tonight and see how this actually works. Yeah, this this iPhone does really, really good, but I still got to get new lighting and get a new holder because, man, I, I hate that the camera bounces around 24-7. These are some of the autos that I've gotten. I got a Ray Black. 
rookie card. Here's my first first ever auto right here. This is the uh, Jake Odorizzi. That's a Father's Day. Yeah, I hear you, Philip. I might end up doing something like that myself. I don't know, I'm I'm new to this whole thing, guys. So, you know, I'm I'm having fun with it, but I also I got to figure it out. I'll try to get the best content I can for y'all guys and. It's hard when you're first starting because you really don't know what to do. We got this one. It's an elite turn of the century. It's a Heath Hembry. It's not on card, but it's a nice rookie card auto. Yeah, the the video. When on my first one, it seemed like it just messed up for some reason. I don't know what was going on. And I was hoping that it was working this time. And Philip came on and I was like, hey, can you even hear me? Because <laughs> it wasn't even showing any of y'all's messages or nothing. So I ended up getting my laptop out and I saw that y'all was messaging me. So I apologize, guys. And I got this one out of there. It's a die cut. Helps if I can actually hold it where y'all can actually see it. I never heard of this guy's E Hire Ageranza. This is also a stickered auto. Hey KB, thanks, bud. I'm I'm just trying to figure it out. This one was numbered also. This was 52 out of 75. So it was it was a cool pull. And Philip, this is courtesy of you right here, bud. These were my first Cardinal autos. I love these, man. Thank you so much for sending these. This one right here is Jim Edmonds. I love Jim Edmonds growing up. Thought it was really, really cool. Got my wife in here. It's laggy and plays like that. Yeah, it's it's laggy for some reason. They said it had some issues going on. Or right, here's a Jack Clark that you sent me. Love this auto. It's pretty cool. Yeah, Edmonds was a beast, Philip. He was very, very awesome. I'm glad that we picked him up and he did so well with us. And of course, you know, we had him, you know, when we won the World Series. So that was, that was awesome. How many people do you have? I, I got five watching right now. But yeah, I'm kind of going through and seeing some of my cards that I've gotten. But here was my four for four hits. Four different 89 boxes, which that one right there was one of them in the back. But I got my four Griffies. None of them was really centered completely. But these two right here were pretty decent. Yeah, three, three for four year year run. Yeah, he he was just rocking house, man. I, defensively and offensively. But I did finally get him out of my last box. I was searching and searching and searching trying to find this one to add to my collection. But he's pretty well centered. 
thought about getting that one graded, but I don't know. We'll see. Did a lot of pulls with my, my daughter and my wife, so he said, hey, Miss Parker. <laughs> hey. But did my 89 brakes, I mean 88 brakes, I got quite a few glavins. This was the score glavin, so it was pretty cool. He's finally getting his man cave. Yeah, well. I was thinking about music room, but it become a baseball room. <laughs> oh, but well. Got as some long old as tommies. he's happy. Oh, yeah. All right. I'll leave you alone. All right. Have a good night, everyone. We got Shohei Otani rookie card here, and that was out of the uh, the holiday. We got a Pete Alonzo rookie. That was my first ever opening up the 2019 tops. Another Shohei. And I pulled several of these Craig Biggio rookies. So I really liked like those. And a lot of those are just standard for some people, but man, I, I really like breaking some older stuff because I mean, I lost everything that I had. So when it comes to this kind of stuff, man, I get pretty dang excited. You know, when I pull some decent ones that I, that I used to have. Now the Griffies, I never had the Griffey rookie. So that was my first ever. So I was, when I was, Breaking and pulled that first one, man. I was shaking. <laughs> Check this out. It's a coming attractions. Chipper Jones and Ryan Kalesko. This is one of the cards I thought I lost. And my brother ended up having it. I thought that was pretty dang cool. Hey, John Arcade. How you doing, buddy? All right, let's see here. All right. One of these other cards out of the way here real quick. did pull these out of the Fairfield tonight. It was just some older Cardinal cards that I can add to my Cardinal collection. Check out this Alan Bennis, Cardinal's top prospect. I was like, hmm, okay. Oh, check this out. There's a Daryl Strawberry. It's a 91 Fleer pack that, I, that was in that. That's the 12 of 12. I thought that was pretty neat. I've never seen these. But I did get this Aussie. Look at that. I've been doing good, John. It's been a really, really good day. Does my video keep lagging out? On y'all. <laughs> Don and Aaron, to thank y'all for watching, supporting me.
Oh, dang. Yeah, I might have to rethink my situation in here with the internet. I'm, I'm hoping all that will get fixed for too long also, so I apologize, guys. Hey, Andy Dave. But, go ahead and continue a little bit here. Hopefully it doesn't do too bad on y'all guys. Got an Aussie Albies rated rookie. Victor Robles rated rookie. Yonder Alonso. That one was numbered 34 out of 99. Got the Walker Bueller rated rookie with optic. Yes, ain't that the truth, John? Thing technology. Check this out, guys. I thought that was pretty neat when I pulled this. There's a George Brett out of tops, and it was numbered also 27 out of 50. Pulled several, like, you know, out of tops, you know, like the gold cards and stuff, but nothing really good, good out of them. But check out this card. I love this thing. Can't believe I pulled it out of Urban's. Had several. This is one of the first things my wife decided to buy me, which ain't great cards, but it's that big league. But I pulled some numbered stuff out of it. I got this one out of Don Russ. It's Miggy. It was 36 out of 3695. 3 Another Shohei rookie, an Eli Jimenez rookie. Yeah, just kind of doing some sorting and just kind of chilling out tonight. Probably won't be on very, very long. But check this out. That was pretty neat, I thought. It's the Miguel Tejada. It's a blue. It wasn't numbered or anything, but I thought it was pretty neat. I pulled some of this stuff out. Here you go. Jose Canseco, what do you think of that, that Philip? It's pretty cool. Got that out of the Topps Gallery pack that I picked up on clearance. Picked up a lot of this stuff on clearance. This is a Legends card, Craig Biggio. I found this card. It was kind of rare. I just picked, picked it up from a, a yard sale and it was in a pack. I was like, hmm. That's pretty neat though. Caveman, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got started my collection here, which I got to still go through and kind of sort out. Man, I got all kinds of stuff. But here's another one of those Glavins. Of course, you know, Gary Sheffield, he was in there in the uh, 89 set. We got some Barry Bonds. There you go. Roger Clemens. What do you think of that, Philip? <laughs> that was out of the 88 score. 
John Smoltz. Kurt Schilling, rookies. Oh, that was pretty neat. They got the 5,000 Ks. Larry Walker, rookie. Yeah, gotta love the rocket. The Sammy Sosa. Jose Canseco. Out of 90 set. David Justice. The back of the 5,000. Find that real quick. So, Lynn Nolan Ryan Jr. Your highlights. Yeah, I got several of these these cars like this. That's just kind of kind of different. Let's say I told you I picked up several of those Biggios. So if any of y'all don't have a busy old rookie card, just holler at me. We got the red Shane D's card. I thought that was pretty neat. Got a... Uh, Jake Marid Marisnik press proof. It's thirty two out of one ninety nine. Yeah, it's not the error card. I I kind of looked at it to see if it was, but but I've got an old ninety one Don Russ. It's a no hit A's card as the highlights. These are some I actually found at a yard sale and just picked them up and then. There's like big packs of them for like 50 cent. That's just some of them I kept. Got some Mike Trout cards, which I didn't pay $2 for them to come in a, a grab bag set. But check this out. That's Pete Rose. Somebody's asking me about Pete Rose the other night. I don't remember who it was. Yeah, they had a whole lot of the errors that, that year, Hobby. We had a uh, pack wars not too long ago when we did the gems of the game. And I was like, man, this is going to be my first ever, you know, great. And I was so excited, you know. I pulled the first one out for my wife. And I was like, well, that could have been a whole lot better. But that's the Dexter Fowler World Series. I was like, well, okay. At least it's graded. And then they, I pulled mine out and it's the exact freaking card. So I got two of these dang things, mint pen. I like Dexter, Dexter Fowler. I was like, really? Yeah, and that's right, Philip. I, I got to where I just... I was wanting to try them and just give it a whirl for a pack wars, and I won't ever buy them again. I didn't care for them at all. I pulled this the other night. I was like, well, it's not bad. 
It's Brandon Finnegan, but it had like a rough texture on the front. And it was numbered 11 out of 99. I was like, well, that's pretty neat. Here's some of my numbered cards, guys. Like this one. It's 34 out of 68 Chad Bettish rookie card out of Don Russ. It's the 68 strikeouts in the 2013 season. I really like this one. It's the Elite Dominator. Paul Goldschmidt. It's 419 out of 999. Aaron Judge fran franchise features. Got this one out of a break. I actually, I actually lost this in a uh, a break at the end of of it. He, he he, I think he rolled a dice or something. I actually lost, but the other guy I don't remember who it was. He's like, just give that to Parker. I don't want it. That's Ty Cobb and Bryce Harper. Oh, you hate, you hate Paul Goldschmidt? But I got this in Urban's break. It's Edgar Martinez rookie. This is Shohei's rookie debut card. Rookie card. I went ahead and kept most of these that I had of Shohei just so I'd just in case factor, which I honestly don't think it's going to be worth anything now. I don't think he's going to come back from all that. Hey, NZ. But check this out. This was an elite series, Shohei Otani. That's a pretty nice card. Andrew McCutcheon has like the race stripes. It was uh, 84 out of 149. Pretty good color on it. Jacoby Ellsbury. It's like an orangish gold color. It's 3 out of 60. Oh really? I figured he would he'd be one of them that would actually do that stuff for everybody. I never got to meet him, so I don't know what kind of person he actually is in real life. I just know I like him as a ball player. He's a dang good ball player. But this one is Alexi Ramirez. It's like a purple. And it was uh sixty six out of ninety nine. Then a Brandon uh, Finnegan rookie card. It was a red parallel looking. It was 114 out of 125. Bautista. Hey, Mom, you're watching. Hey, everybody say hi to my mom. It's Beverly there. Just testing out the live stream, Mom, seeing what it what it's all about and see if I can get it figured out. This Bautista was a uh, 62 out of 149. I like this one, man. I'm, I'm a big camo guy. So I saw this camo in the back. I was like, man, that's pretty nice. And, but it was numbered also. It was 86 to 199. Anthony Rizzo. It's got the the checkered in the background, 72 of 149. This one's kind of the red checkered. That's Ben Zobrist when he was with, with uh, Oakland. It was 94 out of 125. Had a nice Matt Holiday blue. I actually didn't notice this card when I first went through the stacks and ended up having to comment later saying that it was numbered. It was uh, out of 50. It was 9 out of 50. 
check this one out, Philip. It's somewhat numbered or anything, but it was cool to get a, a new style Griffey. Oh, I wish that was his real rookie, dad nab. But I went ahead and kept it anyway. Any Mike Trout's a good Mike Trout. Yeah, thanks, Tom. I really like that that Griffey. It was pretty nice. This is a Wilson Ramos. Ain't number, but it's just a gold series and a Raphael Devers 2019 Don Russ series. Got the kid. Future stars, Bo Jackson. And here you go. There's your Kirby. You like that, Devers? You want that, Philip? If you want it, it's yours, buddy. You just let me know. Yeah, it's my first stream, but I'm just kind of going through and I was just trying to figure out how this actually works tonight guys i probably won't be on here very much longer but i know it's running kind of slow i need to figure that part of it out that'd be awesome all right it's yours bud i'll make sure and get that in your next next set that i'll be sending you all right so as everybody knows i pc mark mcguire so this is all I really got of him as of right now, just because I haven't had much cards since I lost almost everything I had. But this is the one I was confused about. So rookie sluggers, 87 rookie sluggers. This is an 88 card. So would this be considered his actual one of his rookie cards or would this be the next year card? Somebody tell me. Hey pirate, hey truth. Hey Bobby. This card has got me confused. I'm not sure. It's 87 highlights. You can tell I got duplicates. So that was the first year of score. Gotcha. Okay. So I pulled some out of here when I did my 89 break. Got this MVP card out of Don Russ. Got several of his 90s. His 88s. I thought this was cool. It's the Fleer Headliners, 88s. Got that from Urban. And these are some that Philip sent me. Thought they was really, really nice. Thank you, bud. Turn back the clock. Boys with the wood. It's 387 career home runs. Prime number. Which this one was numbered. I didn't even notice that it was even numbered until my daughter looked at it. She's like, Daddy, what's these numbers? About 73 out of 387.
<laughs> it's going to get a little bit larger. <laughs> I hope so. I've been trying to pull as many as I possibly can out of some sets and stuff that I've been opening up, but haven't really found a whole lot of Meguiars here lately. Truth, I'm not truth, but uh, Philip, I'm going to set that up here. That way you can just have a, a good look at that the rest of the night because it will be coming your way. But I've got this in a bag. All my Ronald Acunas. <laughs> you can dig it. <laughs> Thanks, Bobby. I thought that one was really cool. I got that out of a break. I think that was Elkanon, I think. The future is bright. Albies and Acuna. Here's his rookie card. Check this. Bats down. This is out of Holiday. Hey, George. Check this out, guys. I got this out of the break the other night with my wife. We was doing Pack Wars. That's pretty neat. Yeah, I've, I've been trying to collect, you know, mainly, you know, Mark McGuire, Griffey, and the Cardinals. So, I know a lot of people don't like the Cardinals, but... What people don't know was I was actually a Braves fan growing up. Which was kind of kind of rare for me. But I, I was a Braves fan when they had the five aces. Remember the five aces? It's the losing years. <laughs> Trader. <laughs> yeah, I was a Braves fan back in the day. Don't get, uh, I don't know why, but I was. But I started hanging out with a, a group from my church because, uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a drummer at heart. So I play drums, guitar, bass, piano, anything really, and sing. Yep, Maddox, Smoltz, Glavin. Uh, let's see, Maddox, Smoltz, Glavin. Who was the others? Check these out. I got these out of the pack the other night. I was like, shoot, I know it's old, you know, new style Mickey Mantle, but shoot, I'd take them. Thought they was pretty cool. Yeah, I got with a, some church friends, and man, they every weekend we get out of church, go eat, and go back to his house, and we just sit back and chill out for a while. And he'd always have on a cardinal ball game. A <laughs> mantle. <laughs> you don't like mantle? What's wrong with you? I did pull these out of the pack the other day. I thought that was pretty cool. Nice Frank Thomas. Rocket had a couple die cuts. That's Maglio, Hank Aaron. I got this Griffey, it's him and his dad. Got that out of the optic pack the other day. Here's Jose, okay, Jose Canseco 4040 Club. You got that one, Philip? The 
59 and counting. Got a bunch of Bo Jacksons out of that one. Nolan Ryan. Jose Canseco MVP. Anybody like the Astros? Because I got several Astros cards that I'm not going to keep. So you got several of them? Okay. There's another Biggio rookie. I was going to send you this, Philip, the other day when I sent the packs, but I couldn't because this was my, my wife's first card she pulled, and it, it was numbered. So it's the J.D. Martinez Heritage sticker, 10 out of 15 photos. Oh, you so you got everything from the Jungle Wax there? Okay. So you collect mainly the 90s Astros? Okay. Hey, thanks for watching, Truth. Appreciate you. Yeah, I, I got that one, and I got two of the Paul Goldschmidt's J.D. Martinez. Uh, I'm not Jamie Martinez, but two Paul Goldschmidt, you know, photo variation, just like that. But I did get some more of these when I opened up my 88. Got some Cal Ripkins. Jose Fernandez, Diamond King. I've been trying to keep all the Diamond Kings. I don't know. I just like the sits. The Mike Trout. Check out that Jeter. I thought that Jeter was pretty cool. Another Jose Canseco. Nolan Ryan. Kyle Ripken. It's a Jackie Robinson Day Alex Wood. There's another Clemens. To have the Vladdy and Tati sticker. Thought it were the regular rookies, but was confused when you saw the back. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. I like the nineties because they're the years. I almost saw in baseball, okay. Yeah, the 90s had the good players. Nolan Ryan, baseball hero. That was out of an upper, upper deck pack. <laughs> I did a video the other night, and my little girl, I said, there's a Daryl Strawberry, and she's like, did you say strawberry? Oh, I love strawberries. Where's the strawberries? <laughs> little girl had me just laughing. I almost couldn't even concentrate when I was doing my... My video that night. You like the Maddenly? Reggie Sanders. It's an old one. Also, and that that break I did that I got the Griffey. I also pulled the the Cecil Fielder out of there. Yeah, she's a mess, ain't she, Philip? Here's a Chris Archer. It was out of two, uh, 217, 2017, 758. I thought that was nice. Now, I had to actually look this card up because I had no clue if this was even close to his, his rookie year because on the back, it just showed Birmingham and then 90 White Sox. But then I looked at the card year I was like, oh, okay, so this ain't, ain't his rookie. But I thought that was pretty nice. And I pulled the Randy Johnson here on the tops. This one's kind of bent up, but I got this one at a yard sale too. But check this. Pulled the Shohei Otani. That's the pink parallel rated rookie. <laughs> yeah yeah kids always say the funny thing especially my daughter man she she cracks me up 
I get to laughing so hard at her. Here's a Carlos Correa pink for Astros. Here you go, Jave. How do you actually say your pronounce your name? J Faith. J Faith. Jave. Miggy Diamond Kings pink parallel. And here's a, a Lance McCullers All Star pink. I really like this one. Cal Ripken pink. Jaffa. Okay. Jaffa. Okay. I'll just call you Jaffa. Whole lot easier. A Cal Ripken and a Joey Votto was my other pink. Jose Altuve. Zach Grinke. Giancarlo. Brian Dozier. Legends Jose Canseco. And then another Tom Glavin rookie. Uh, if you like Iron Man, I got something to show y'all here in just a minute. If you watched the video, you probably already seen them, but check out that old Ozzy, eighty-one, Don Russ. It's pretty neat. Hey, Mountain, how you doing? Look at that mantle. Another Ozzy, Mark Grace. And these were the uh, the ones I got out of there. It's the metallics, I guess you could say. Out of Holiday. That is Eric Hosmer, Jake Arietta, Kluber, Strasburg. Where do y'all think Strasburg's going to wind up going? That's Alex Avila. This was numbered 131 out of 219. I pulled this out of the pack, and I was like, man, what is this one? I've never seen these cards. Average fastball extension, Tyler Glasnow. I was like, well, I'll go ahead and sleeve it. I don't know. I've never seen them. Tim Anderson. That one was out of 2017. Good old Bo. Legends in the Making, Mike Trout. These are a couple of gold cards. Another bow. I collect bow also. That's another one. Y'all remember these cards? Oh my gosh. How do you think you'll stay with the, the Nats? Old school King Griffey Jr. Score. Now you was talking about the Tops Nolan Ryan 5000 earlier. Is this the one you was talking about? Nope, that wasn't it. Okay. Got several Nolan Rhines, Bo Jackson. Got several Kurt Schilling rookies, if any of y'all need a Kurt Schilling rookie. I pulled these out of there. I thought these were pretty neat cards. I thought about buying this whole, whole box and just open them up. That's the exponentials. That's a Ramos Ramirez. 
Jeff Kent, and then A-Rod. Gold. Yeah, there was, as far as I, I heard, there was a whole lot of error cards for Nolan Ryan, but I've never had one or anything, so let me get up real quick and find this other set I told you about with the Cal Ripken. I knew I had these when I was a kid, and I was like, man, I wonder where this got off to, because I knew I lost a lot of my stuff back in the day and never found none of it until my brother called me up and said, hey, man, I, I found these. Do you want these back? And I was like, absolutely, I do. So let me get these ready, move some of these cards out of the way. But since I've just kind of started back into collecting, I don't really have... A whole whole lot yet, but like I said, I'll I'll get there. I got a decent collection started so far. But check this out. Have you ever seen these? No, they're not giant sleeves. I actually I put them together and I laminated them to where I can actually keep them all together like that. These are the only three that I actually, you know, pulled out of, you know, my boxes here. Because this is all I've ever opened up is this right here. But I'm trying to collect all the puzzles. So eventually, you'll see some more sitting up on the wall here. Kind of decorating the background. All right, so here's what we got in this Iron Man set. And these, listen, they are 10. These are 10 cards. That's Cal Ripken Jr. And this one is Lou Gehrig and Cal. It's got gold border. Any extra from the Yaz? Yeah, let me take a look. I'm not sure if I do or not, Philip. But uh, if I do, I'll, I'll definitely hook you up with them. And there's the last one. Just Lou Gehrig. But yeah, I love, love these cards. And I was glad I found them again. And it was the only ones that actually came in this box. And I was like, why such a big 10 for a, that many cards? But... These are called metallic impressions. But yeah, definitely keeping those in my collection for sure. All right. But I did pull this ton tonight and this tonight. This one was uh, numbered 752 out of eight, 899. I did a, a video earlier went and bought some of these today. I bought six. I bought three and my mom bought me another three. So I'm gonna do two more pack war videos with those. It'll probably be me and my wife on them, but this one was number 319 out of 799. Casey Solstice. I don't know if y'all have ever heard of him from Miami. But that'll go on my hit stack. That's another one of my autos. And this Devers, I will get sent to you, Philip, for sure. But I got several more kind of put up. I got a whole box full of just rookies and, you know, some vintage cards that I started collecting. But I got three more boxes of 88 Donruss that I haven't even opened up yet. And I got one more of the 88 score that I haven't opened. But I'm going to try to get some, like, 87 and all that stuff you know, I just want to get back some of the stuff I've lost in the past so 
hopefully I can find some pretty reasonable price where I can pick up off of eBay or something because I can't find nothing around here. I have no card stores anywhere. All I got is Walmart and junk like that, and you definitely ain't going to find none of that up there. But yeah, Philip, I'm going to definitely be yelling at you because I couldn't even figure out how to even get this thing running a while ago. But yeah, I'll figure it out eventually. All right. Jane Greer for eBay ID. Okay, that's what I asked for Philip. Okay. Uh, Chad, I'm kind of looking for, like, I want to get the 87 sets. Uh, I still want to get the eight, the rest of the 89s. I really want to get that 89 Fleer so I, in the upper deck. That way I can get the Griffey rookies out of it. Um, stuff like that. Now, the 88, man, I bought um, five boxes off of eBay. I ended up buying five of the 88, three of the 88 score and four of the 89 Don Russ for around a hundred bucks total. And that was shipping and all. So I got a steal on all that. Um, and that 89, not 89, but the 90 Don Russ, that was actually donated to me from a friend of mine that lives down the street. He found out I had a YouTube channel and was just like, here, man, just have fun. So that's my first ever box opening that I ever did of an actual you know, 36 count, you know, box. So, yeah, I'm, I've been having a lot of fun here lately. I just wished I could afford to do a whole lot more with it. Just picked up three hobby boxes of the 91 upper deck. Nice, chat. All right, Philip. Yeah, I'm definitely going to call you, man. I'd like to be able to kind of set this up and do it the right way and be able to figure this out. You run things a lot smoother anyway. But all right, guys, um, I'm going to think about getting off here. My phone's starting to die on me, but I definitely appreciate y'all coming out and hanging with me and just chilling with me for my first live stream. So that's... 12 watching now is what it's showing. But man, I appreciate y'all guys so, so much. Great community. I love y'all guys. Been killing it tonight, huh? Awesome. I'm glad y'all enjoyed it. I'm glad y'all even stayed to watch me. Thank you, chat. Chat town, appreciate you stopping by, bud. Have a good night, y'all. Take care.